Hey, hi friends, this is Lydia with Applique Market. Today I want to show you how to do a three letter monogram in three different patterns. Um, these, this can be our Crimson Game Day set or any of our other patterned um, fill monograms that we've released. Let's start by using the Embrilliant software. I recommend the Embrilliance Express. It's a free software that you can download and it's for use with BX file formats, which we offer with all of our files. Okay, so to make our three letter monogram, we are going to use the Create Letters tool three different times. So let's click on it for the first letter and we're going to put the left or the first letter in our monogram. Okay, so I am um, going to use the circles pattern first, and I'm going to use a seven inch size and place it um, where I want it. And then I'm going to do that process again. Click on the create letters button and this time, instead of putting my last in name initial or the center letter, I'm going to do a space and then my letter and then another space. And you can see that this brings up the center letter design. Basically, this allows you to do a three letter monogram in different patterns or you can simply use the center initial for single letter designs. So I'm gonna go and change this pattern to the loops in the seven inch. And then I'll do the create letters button one more time. And this time I will do a space and then another space and then the last letter or my middle initial and click set again. So this now can be changed to our last pattern. And you can see that you now have a three letter monogram in the circle shape, but each letter is in a different pattern. Now you can simply save it like this. Um, I go ahead and put a box around the entire monogram click my center design button and this centers it in the hoop and then you can save it just like this. Now note that if you save it with all of the letters in the same color it will plan to stitch the same color. So what I like to do sometimes is to stitch this in different colors when I have the three different patterns. So to do that you would click on your first letter come over to the right side and select the color tab, double click the color, and then just change it to um, whatever color you choose. Um, we'll do a green or a lime for this one. And then we'll repeat that process with the second or the middle and the last letter. So we'll do a red, and then the last letter, color tab, and maybe for this one we'll do, um, let's do a yellow. Okay, so now when I go and save the file, um, it will let me stitch each letter in a different color. It will already be prompted to do that. Oops. So hopefully this helps you and please feel free to reach out and ask questions. You can email us at contact at appliquemarket.com or you can find us on Facebook. Um, we also have a Facebook group called Applique Market Friends where you're welcome to ask questions there. Thank you so much.